Hey guys, so today we're going to be reviewing the 1991 KFC toys, which these ones were um, exclusive to Canada, whereas uh, they did release three uh, the different versions of Alvin, Simon and Theodore for uh, America and Canada as well, but these ones are just the Canadian ones because they have their instruments. Um, the, Amer the other ones, they were just posed like... Um, I know Alvin had his arms crossed and then the other two were kind of like, like standing. They were, didn't have instruments. Anyway, um, so, so to begin with this, we have Alvin and, um, he comes with his guitar and he's got his, his hat and he's wearing his, uh, iconic jumper from the cartoons uh, and the the heads of these can move as well which is pretty cool so you can have him facing like that or whichever way you want him to be faced so yep and then his guitar his arms can move up like this so that he can play guitar like that. And then his, he's got his A for Alvin, obviously. Um, so he uh, he's got his hair. His hair is quite very similar to the cartoons. I don't know if you can see here it's even got like a little bit of tough going up um so that's quite cool and his fingers look like he's strumming the guitar so i'm just falling down at the back okay uh so yeah i think these this is a really good likeness of alvin because it's got his guitar and it looks exactly like how he does from the cartoons, except like the 90s cartoons and late 80s. So yeah, he's really cool. And the paint job's really well done on him. Um, yeah, so that's Alvin. And then next we have Simon. Who's playing the uh, saxophone, I believe. And that's the side of him. And then this is the back. So they've got his, like, his figure, correct, and how, like, his slimness, and he's got his glasses, which are fixed on, uh, and he can play the saxophone, you can lift his arms up so that it looks like he's playing the saxophone, and then his head also twists as well, like, uh, like Alvin's. Which is really good. Um, so you can have him just like smiling, or you can have him playing his instrument. Either way, he's it's pretty cool. And so yeah. And then we have Theodore. Now he plays the drums these drums here and you can have him this way playing the drums like that or you can have him this way or that way or whichever way you like this here is blue because these are fairly old um it, it's like just dried glue and it's just dried up uh so that's his drums and then the Theodore figure himself is sitting on a little, uh, like a stall, so he can reach the drums. Um, his arms can move up and down as well, and they both go together, so like one doesn't just go up and the other one can stay where it is. Um, he's really cute. His head also moves around, even though it looks really quite freaky right now. But yeah, uh, he's got massive teeth. In case you didn't see, um, he's got a little scuff on his nose, 
but um, it's quite hard to find these. Well, it's not, but these were a fairly cheap price, and for the condition, they're really good. And um, it's quite it's fairly hard to find Theodore with his drums, so that's why I bought him. But to be honest with you, it doesn't really matter about the scarf. Um, so that's the back of him, and he's got his, his hair is really well done, and uh, so yeah, so he can be there, and then he's like on his drums, like this. So you can have him play the drums like boom, boom, <laughs> if you want, whichever way you want. So yeah, um, the good thing about these uh, toys is that um, they're really well done. They've even got like Simon's shoes the right colour and Alvin's shoes the right colour and Theodore's, which are a light blue, if you can see. So they're fairly accurate <clears throat> to the actual cartoons of the time that they were made. Um, and they've got the right instruments. And I just think they're really cool. Um, so yeah, that's really the review today. Uh, I'm going to be making a couple more reviews on some items that I've got. These, I s guess you could say, are fairly vintage. But... um. If they were 1991 is when they were released, which is quite old now. But, I mean, these are like 28 years old? I don't know. They're fairly, they've, like, they're fairly good for their age, I guess you could say. So, yeah, that's really the end of this one. Thanks for watching, and feel free to describe. Sub subscribe, not describe, because that's what I've just done. But anyway, bye!